To turn, a cyclist must find himself a centripetal force. He does this by turning the handlebar so that a frictional force acts in a centripetal direction. But the frictional force has a side effect. While the lines of action of the weight and normal contact force passes right through the center of gravity of the cyclist, the line of action of the frictional force doesn't. The frictional force produces a clockwise moment. This unbalanced moment topples the cyclist outward. Assuming the cyclist doesn't enjoy falling off the bike, he must learn to lean into the turn. By leaning into the turn, he positions his CG away from the normal contact force. This allows the normal contact force to produce an anti-clockwise moment to counter the frictional force's clockwise moment. The trick is to attain a net moment of zero. In fact, the cyclist learns to lean just enough so that the resultant contact force passes right through his CG. Basically, the cyclist leans to maintain rotational equilibrium.